Hi guys, welcome to the Voice of Source. My name is Julia. I'm super happy, Santa Cups, to see you here. This is gonna be a reading for Capricorn. I get the most views on my Capricorn videos, so thank you very much for being here. Thank you for subscribing. I love your energy, guys. Coming unstuck in your enlightened beings. <laughs> this is going to be the four elements bonus reading so what we're going to do i already pre-shuffled all the cards but i'm just going to do one in front of you and we're going to split the deck in four parts earth water uh, a lot of water there, a lot of cards for water, um, fire and air, so the first card, the hermit, seven of wands, star, the hangman is out in the reverse, just like we saw it earlier, great, so we're looking at the earth energy, right? Because we're a combination of different elements. And as you know, you can have a rising one sign, you can have moon and another sign. So you have a lot, you have probably most likely at least three. I would say it's always probably more than two, uh, most, most likely, right? but you could have up to the four elements but also all these four elements represent different energies in our body right so we're looking at the earth and the earth is about the body and the self so we're looking at your internal um state of being so and your internal state of being is the hermit the first card that we have and two major con three major corners right there Be i mean i think you're super focused on how you are feeling inside. So there's quite a lot of powerful energy that's going there, right? A lot of focus. So yeah, you might be, it's the weekend, obviously that I'm doing the reading for, but we're looking for the rest of the August. That's what's gonna happen. You're gonna still be in this energy of retrospection and of healing, looking for ideas and how to become the best version of yourself how to be how to manifest your most potential and this thought process even you're gonna from today onwards until uh the end of the month you're gonna be more secluded in terms of taking your time off from all the external energies or environments and you kind of kind of sort of guard yourself and protect you create a little bit of the wall and what you will do there in this sort of state of being, so this is internally, right? You're gonna start looking at how to make the most balance, how to achieve that, which is your wish come true, your, you know, your, how to be a star, like, you know, the star for yourself, how to be the best, best, shiny self and you're gonna have a lot of ideas that are gonna come through you're gonna really receive the download and you you're gonna come out by the end of the month and september is gonna be probably more the manifestation of that so now it's more like you're you're conducting this idea this power you're generating the the hope of what shall become and you're healing in this process because you kind of really feed in nurturing yourself and during this introspection and mm, meditation. Okay, both cards I saw during the shuffle. This is the third card that's during the shuffle. Okay, five of wands, three of pentacles, the temperance, and the queen of pentacles reversed. So, Capricorn. So we're looking at the water element, right? Or the emotions, your yin energy, 
your immediate environment. This is not internal the body, but external to the body, the first immediate, your home, some of the elements of that. So, uh, yeah, still there is some conflict uh, around the people maybe that are within your sort of immediate reach and within your house. So there's a need, there's advice from um, source to be more, to hold your temper, right? To, to be um, more patient if you can. See beyond the pain of the people who surround you to understand that, that they're really hurting maybe on some level and if you can rise above it and with the help of uh, we'll see what's gonna be on the spirit level but on the yeah on the level of emotion and your yin you need to really take it and stop a, 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 a notch backwards in a sense that you want to be more gentle with yourself in this situation because you're kind of coming out as the queen of pentacles reverse you internalizing a lot of the process and you still not you need to be more gentle more mm, bring this energy of calm and peace feel into the energy of yin right calling for Kuan yin as well like right so compassion love for the self so that your earthly energy is manifested so you turn um, your queen of pentacles upwards and in in, 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 a, in a way and it's i know it's a bit frustrating that someone you're collaborating with could be someone close to you like i said could be a very close friend or uh, even the family business but there's some squirrels like the squirrels <laughs> how do you say it? squirrels 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 oh my god squirrels there's definitely some squirrels around hilarious um and you are looking into that i think you are taking your time you're kind of protecting yourself at the moment from taking time off or trying to shield or like close yourself in a room if you're sharing your home and making and trying to be as patient and as slow as possible for you to like bring yourself back into this upward position it's not like it's super emotional to feel like you are just you know really exuding that frustration or anything but i do think it it can it gets to you it's getting to you that's why you're on inter on internal we see this kind of super powerful and connected to the divine introspection there's still connection to the divine so just be with your emotions just be passionate passionately compassionate to yourself <laughs> trying to reverse the word obviously um, more compassionate and more pa peaceful and more careful with your emotions stay out of conflict of course obviously in your uh fire element we've got the king of wands reverse the death ace of pentacles knight of pentacles reverse knight of pentacles reverse like everywhere now i need to get them to upright people <laughs> but the ace of pentacles is there so under the star and the temperance and the ace of pentacles that's a great combo okay so whatever whoever is this you the school the squirrel the quarrel the quarrel that you're having with it's a squirrel because it's a fiery sign and it's in reverse and but it looks orange it's a squirrel for sure
I think you want to end this connection. This person, I think, has a not a super positive effect on you. Side piece. Why did I? Why do I hear side piece? Are they are they keeping you as a side piece, or have they been a side piece? Is there somebody else? There's just some information can prove that there is two people apart from you, right? So this King of Wands is not in the upright. And that's who you're having the arguments with, yeah? The quarrels, I mean. <laughs> and you would like to put an end to this uh, relationship. I don't know whether you're still sharing home together. There's some indication of that. And you want to begin something new. And that's why you have the Star of Temperance and Ace of Pentacles, yeah? You're not quite uh, ready to go fully, like, too deep into something new because the Knight of Pentacles reverse, but you're happy to begin the the the, the most in like paramount, so important steps, like but just the initial ones, proper ones. It's not like you know joke. I think you might consider investing in something. You've got an idea about something that you believe and it it is true will be a success will make you a star as in put you in front of people and will help you not help you will actually allow for your uh, um outmost potential to be expressed and manifested in the physical world it's a good idea and i you're, you're not quite ready to go full steam ahead, but you, you're making the first steps, so you will be making the first steps. And this is in the environment of outside of your home, right? The community, your work, your creative self, and also the element of fire also relates to the, uh, the sexual energy as well. So this person doesn't really help you in a way. I think you're starting to realize you can do this on your own. Whatever that idea is, you just have to be a bit more patient before you like really spring. It's just, it's just the initial first seed of intention, but it's a physical, it's like, okay, I'm gonna make my first down payment. Right, I'm gonna be ready to sign that contract, but um, I do want to build this, but I'm not sure I want to do it this with this person. I think you're coming slowly to by the end of the month to realization of the fact you get this idea. Yeah, it's come becoming much clearer to you that actually this person only creates the quarrels, <laughs> the squirrels. And um, so I would like to build this new business, let's say, but perhaps I'm not going to take my partner. And I feel it could be even be a partner, like you probably live with this person. Something like this is coming through because, okay. Yeah, okay, so <laughs> now there is three people. Told you about this, but I remember your last reading as well. You had to like, there was a choice or something. There was, so the third person is here. So we got on your element of air, we've got, the, what is it? A six of swords, <sighs> the king of pentacles, Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups and a Nine of Cups. All right, so I think you believe that this person who is the King of Pentacles is your wish fulfillment. You'd rather emotionally connect and express and invest your energy to this person and you would like to move somewhere closer to where this person is 
However, they're coming up as a reverse and the death is just above them. So it's funny, but they, you probably, and you could have even ended with both of them. So you're thinking of ending both of connection with both of these people. Really, they're coming both. I mean, all of you are in reverse. You are in reverse because you obviously are, I was going to say struggling, struggling with sorting the situation because these two people are not really up to your standard, let's put it this way. Um, but this King of Pentacles, the way they're coming through, It's like they could be interested to move closer to where you are and making making this sort of emotional offer. They want you. I feel like all of a sudden they want you. So they're going to connect to you emotionally. This king of wands, on the other hand, it's like you put an end to this. And there they come with like a, a more solid offer. I mean like small steps seed but it's a bit more concrete uh, it's an ace of Pentacles the king of Pentacles is more with an you know in the energy of cups so they do see you as wish fulfillment they would like to extend their a love offer and I think they're prepared to make a move towards you This Knight of Wands, or Knight, sorry, King of Wands, apologies. They put, need to put an end to something else, I think, as well in their life. There is some other energy that could be related to them that they need to an end, put an end as well before they offer you this Ace of Pentacles. Yeah. But at the moment, it's all, it's an, it's a, it's like whatever, the way you have been connected to these people is now, there's an end to it. So there could be a continuation of connecting with these people, but on different energy because of you, because what you did, you've done with taking time for yourself, for your healing, for introspection for really figuring out what is it that you want and you just need to be a little more patient uh, for your energy to like flip over so and you are excited about some of this this new venture and idea okay and in terms of so the future which is a like the furthermost future the end of the month and spilling into the beginning of the next and it's almost like you could be returning to where this king of pentacle is or they coming to you with a love offer and in a way it kind of makes you very happy it's a wish fulfillment for you and you are you kind of feel i feel like you know even that they're gonna do that interesting and what else can I say in regards to the energy of air? So this is more, I think on a, again, on a soul level, I want to say that this person is more, yeah, they're uh, closer to you. And, um, We got an Eastern master, so there's something about this person that makes them a masterful uh, being. And they could be from a different background, an unusual background that is a, um, and they somehow able to tame you. It's like, they've got this, got this power over you. I don't know, that's what just came through. But it kind of reminds me of like the strength card, you know, they've got the core, 
whether they get the courage or the to do it but they know how to treat how to like sweep you off your feet or how to how to really get into your good graces and how to you know tame you they know how to tame you i don't know how in the world because of their approach through the emotions maybe yeah obviously the quarrels with the king of wands does don't help but you know with that your relationship with this person and because the king of pentacles is on the level of air as in the communication and anything that's ethereal more the the element of mercury right so the but this is not even the sun or the moon this is way out in space right the cosmic energy so this is more the divine I, that's why i say you're more connected to them this is more connected he this person is more connected to the future um however the ace of pentacles which is a much more grounded offer it's coming from the king of, of wands at the moment, I feel you're like, I'm just protecting myself and putting an end to both of these situations. And I think you have to see. Somehow this person is, the king of wands, is able, they're able to do some energetical investment, but they can't give you the full disclosure <laughs> agreement there. So now something else is there because the not a pentacles reverse but and for you on the emotional level somehow the king of pentacles because of the nine of cups and the, your nine of cups is more of a wish for more happiness they fulfill you on the emotional level i guess we're gonna have to see much later on whether these two can come into upright and mm, this eastern master which as i do believe relates to more to your king of pentacles something quite unusual about their their demeanor their background their their knowledge their they're sort of they could be still like a younger energy but they're becoming a master and uh, i think that's kind of appealing to you i'm gonna leave it here thank you for being here capricorns Thank you for subscribing and liking. Please do feel uh, free to comment. Uh, reach out to me over the email, my Instagram. Read about the concept. All the personal readings are there. There's no extended. And I um, hope to see you soon. Hope it resonates. My shop with all the accessories, um, fashion, um, artwork, and what else? And all the healing products is growing and it's uh, available um, on voiceofsource.com in the shop section. Have a look. It's one of a kind, handmade, uh, shamanic or anything that's to do with nature, right? And plants and sustainable, plant-based, naturally dyed, etc., etc. Sort of things anything that's focused on healing and wellness. So I really appreciate you being here. Thank you for your presence. Bye.